I've been monetized for about 10 months now. And in that time, I grew from 2,000 subscribers to 14,000 subscribers. During those 10 months, I actually only posted one video and one short. Today, I'm going to show you guys how much I made with YouTube ad revenue every month since I've been monetized as an, I guess, inconsistent channel. So I got monetized at around 2,000 subscribers and that was around 16 May 2023. So I think most of you guys know what you need to be monetized on YouTube. It's a thousand subscribers and 4,000 watch hours or you can have like, I don't know, a million views on shorts or something like that. I got my thousand subscribers and only later reached the 4,000 watch hours at 2,000 subscribers. So that's why I only got monetized when I reached 2,000 subscribers. I'm not really going to go into detail about what happens after you get monetized as a South African uh, because most of you are not from South Africa. For me, it took like four months after I met the metrics to actually start earning money because of how slow things work in South Africa. <laughs> but anyway, let's talk about the money I made. First of all, I just want to mention the amount of money I make is not the same that another YouTuber makes. It really depends on things like your niche, the countries that people are watching you from, how regularly you upload a video, all those kinds of things play a role. So this is very personal to my channel and as I said, a very inconsistent channel at this stage. For those of you who are wondering where I've been for the past few months, I made a new channel and I posted one video on that channel just explaining where I've been. Okay, so let's get into some analytics. So today is the 12th of March in 2024. So I also just want to show you guys the growth of my channel since starting in April 2020, I think. It really took a long time to get to a thousand subscribers. Here you can see I hit my 1000 subscribers around 29th of October 2022. So that's like a year and a half after I started. And then I haven't even gotten the 4000 watch hours. And then just a while after I got monetized in May of 2023, my channel grew a lot quicker. And it's actually because of one video that I put out. The video is called how I started my stationary business. That video got a lot of traction and that one video is the biggest reason why I um, actually made a good amount of money even though I only posted like one video after that one in the next 10 months of being monetized. So the average CPM in the past 10 months for my channel was seven dollars and 22 cents um, and that is the amount of YouTube money that is made per thousand views on my channel but that is not what I'm getting I get the RPM so that is after YouTube takes their cut and then I am left with $2.86 per thousand views and like I said this is different for every YouTuber. It depends on the niche that you are making the content for, as well as in what countries your viewers are and how consistent you post. The total estimated revenue that I made in the past 10 months is $1,519.62. Now, for a lot of Americans or other first world countries, that doesn't sound like much for a year. But for us in South Africa, this is more than the average salary. I think the average salary in South Africa is around 25,000 Rand, and this would amount to be around 28,000 Rand. So that's a whole extra salary. So in the first month of being monetized, 
I earned $21.90. This was with 7,400 views and just above 2,000 subscribers. The second month, which is June of 2023, I earned $44.47. This was with 13,500 views and I had 2,700 subscribers. Then for July of 2023, which is the third month, I made $134.69 with 57,000 views. And in that time, I had almost 4,500 subscribers. So you can see there, the growth really started. Then for month number four, I made $204.37 with 74,000 views and just under 6,500 subscribers. In September of 2023, month five, I think, I made $255.73 with 77,000 views and I had 8,000 subscribers at this stage. In October of 2023, I made $198.61 with 75, almost 76,000 views and I had almost 10,000 subscribers. November of 2023, I made $163.11 with 38,000 views and I had 10,500 subscribers. Then in December, things picked up a little bit again. I think a lot of people watch like how to start a business kind of videos in December and January. So for December of 2023, I made $193.86 with 60, 61,000 views. And I had almost 12,000 subscribers at that point. Then for this year, January 2024, I made $153.33 with 52,000 views. And at the end of January, I had 13,000 subscribers. And then last month, February of 2024, I made $115.88 with 41,000 views and I had just under 14,000 subscribers. Then so far for this month, I've made $33.66 with 12,000 views and I am on 14,000 subscribers. So now I just want to show you guys like an overview of the last year. So of course the video that made everything grow is not was not posted in the last year and that is the I started a planner and stationary business video as you can see that is the video that brought in the most income for me the second most popular video was posted in April of 2022 um, and here you can see how much revenue that brought in for me and then the third most popular one is the how I created my first planner so here you guys can see how much revenue I earned and here is where my channel really grew so then the revenue also got a spike there and then after I posted a video um, they, then it spiked again um, and it was quite stable for a while and then it went down a bit again when I didn't post. I'll also show you guys the views. Here is where my views spiked and my channel got a lot of growth and then here is the one video that I posted. Things have been quite stable for someone who only posted one video in the last year, which I am so surprised. So if you have been thinking of starting a YouTube channel, I would really recommend it. The extra income, it really, really helps out because things are tough in the world today. And if you can have an extra income source that's kind of passive, why not? So yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you guys found it informative and insightful. 
please let me know in the comments if there's anything else that I missed that you guys uh, would like to know. If you enjoyed this video, I would really appreciate it if you could leave a like. And if you are not subscribed, please consider subscribing. That's it from me, guys. Thank you so much for watching.